The CEO of fintech company Ripple is now offering a bold prediction for what the new year holds in store for the cryptocurrency markets, as he believes that the market-wide purge that was largely anticipated to occur in 2019 will actually take place in 2020. This market-wide consolidation trend that he anticipates to occur in the coming year may have large implications for how the markets will trend in the future, and may even spell trouble for XRP. During a recent episode of The Ripple Drop, a YouTube show hosted by the company, Brad Garlinghouse, the CEO of the fintech company, offered insights into what he believes is going to happen within the cryptocurrency markets in the new year. Notably, he explained that he believes that the majority of the 3,000-plus cryptocurrencies that currently exist within the markets will disappear as investors migrate away from smaller speculative cryptos and towards ones with proven utility. The Ripple CEO further elaborated on this statement, explaining that although there's no telling as to how many of the 3,000-plus cryptos will disappear this year, he does believe that eventually 99% of cryptocurrencies will disappear. It is likely that investors who flee these smaller altcoins that they deem to be useless will not flock to XRP, which may mean that other major cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin and Ethereum will see some decent upwards momentum while XRP remains stuck around its current price levels. Jeffrey Tucker, a prominent economist, recently spoke to Russia Today about XRP, explaining that although it does have significant utility that could help usher in a new global financial system, investors may not be too enthused with it due to it being a specific kind of crypto that is uninteresting to normal investors. Because XRP's specific utility does not necessarily impact consumers and retail investors, the upcoming consolidation phase that the Ripple CEO is anticipating may not have a positive impact on the crypto and may even lead some investors to flee it in favor of other digital assets.